So we're on Rowan Engineering here, and here's a familiar face that you'll see if you follow the field target on my channel. Kev, do you want to just say a bit about the electronic side wheel and what it's what it's all about? What Rowan Engineering have developed, and I've been using one for about two years now, is a digital side wheel reader. Where we'd normally be a bit agricultural, have a piece of tape on a wheel, get a pen, mark it up, that'll do. Get a, get a cheat chart out your pocket with all your clicks on. Yeah. Rowan Engineering's have come up with a clever device called the DSW, where I've already pre-programmed the magic box on the top. You always started off at your minimum range, which is 10 yards on this particular scope. And as I turn the wheel, it will automatically tell you what the range is and give you your click values for competitions like in the GP series. I've inputted 120 seconds, which is a countdown timer. What we've also got at the top corner is a incline and decline. So as you're inclining for doing the uphill or downhill shots, will automatically adjust the click value. What we've also got within the box is high and low temperature settings. So most scopes will move a given maybe two up to five yards. We can five set, in my case. Yeah. <laughs> we can set the high and low temperature. You can click between them or you can set this to totally auto so it will automatically give you your compensation and your clicks or minus them off. Yeah. It's got a compass built in so you can set, you calibrate it to north, you can tell it which way the wind's coming from and as you move in round it will tell you roughly which way the wind's coming from. <laughs> Within one of the features on the screen We've got what the temperature, ambient temperatures at the moment. Yeah. We've got what the cant is we've got a little mini scat. And if you want to be a bit more, when you're standing and you want to see how good you are at standing, we've got a mini scat machine on the, on the screen so you can see it out. How you wobbling. <laughs> it's got a shot trainer, so you can we in field target it's all about repeatability. We want to know how good we can repeat that range on a given distance. So with this, I can move the wheel slightly to remember that range, do it five times, and it will give you your average and your deviation for that given range. Within the, the box itself, it's got Bluetooth capability, so any firmware updates you can do automatically. Voice versa, you can save all your settings, download it to your app, you can also recognise as a shot movement. So when you're on a course, you can record the whole course. You can down that, download that to your app and then find out where you've been missing. Whether it was you being a numpty or whether you got the settings wrong. And that's just <laughs> blown you away. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Any questions? Um, can I have one to test? <laughs> Oh, well, cheers for that. That's, uh, that's amazing. Amazing bit of kit. Yeah. And it helped me. And that's all legal for worlds yeah. and all that. Not, not particularly for the worlds. What, what we did, the Rowan engineering guys, when they wanted to take the legalities of it first, we went to the BFDA and said, "Will this be legal?" Yeah. And there was no objections to it whatsoever. And also, it's got the digital spirit hole in there, so green, amber, or red. So you know you're in Canton, you're good. Well, well, I want one, but uh, how much are they? They're retailing at the show, which is the first time they've been available for £495. Complete kit. That comes <laughs> everything there. Like that. So, uh, wow. That's, uh, yeah. you got to get a bigger paper round. <laughs> yeah, much bigger paper round. <laughs> Thanks very much for that, that's, uh, that's excellent. Yeah. Well, what you can do on the screen as well, you know when you've got people looking over your shoulder, you don't want them to see the range. Yeah. You can turn the range off when you study click value on there. Oh, right. Or vice versa, you can just turn the range and not the click value, or whatever else like that.